on the 26th of June, we remember and honor the Carmelite Saint Blessed Maria Josephine of Jesus Crucified. Born Josefina Catania on 18th February 1894 in Naples, Italy, into a noble family, she was called Pinella by her family. As a young child, she showed great affection for the poor and most needy, giving money to them. She helped to care for two lonely old women. Pinella's mother and grandmother set a good Christian example for her. She was especially devoted to our Lord in the Eucharist and to Mary, praying the rosary often. At an early age, Pinella was convinced that Jesus was calling her to Carmel. Having completed commercial studies and overcoming the opposition of her mother and family members, on 10th March 1918, Josefina entered the Carmelite community at St. Maria Ponte Rossi. As a young religious, she learned to love Christ through suffering, offering herself as a victim for the good of priests. She accepted great physical pain as God's will for her. Josefina was afflicted with tuberculosis of the spine, which completely paralyzed her. She owed her miraculous cure to the intercession of St. Francis Xavier, whose relic was brought to her cell and who appeared to her in a dream. Although she would have been glad to live in solitude, when the news of her miraculous recovery became known outside the community, priests, seminarians and persons of every social class came to Ponte Rossi to receive counsel and consolation from her. In 1932, the Holy See officially recognized the house at Ponte Rossi as a convent of the discarded Carmelites with the name the Carmel of Saints Teresa and Joseph at Ponte Rossi. Pope Pius XI approved the house as a Carmel of the Second Order with papal enclosure, placing it under the jurisdiction of the Archbishop of Naples. Josephina received the Carmelite habit and took the name Sister Maria Josephina of Jesus Crucified. On 6th August 1932, she made her solemn profession according to the Carmelite rule. On the day she took the habit, she said that she wished to offer herself to the crucified Jesus so that she could be crucified with him. She suffered silently but joyfully and abandoned herself to the will of God who favoured her with mystical experiences. In 1934, Cardinal Alessio Ascalesi, the Archbishop of Naples, appointed Sister Maria Josefina the sub-prioress of the Carmel, while in 1945 she became the vicar. That same year, on 29th September, the first general chapter of the Ponte Rossi Carmel elected Sister Maria Josefina the prioress, an office that she held until her death. Already in 1943, she had begun to suffer various physical maladies, including the progressive loss of her sight. She considered her illnesses to be a magnificent gift that allowed her to be better conformed to the crucified Christ. With a cheerful spirit, she offered her body as a sacrifice for souls. She died in Naples on 14 March 1948. In obedience to her spiritual director, Sister Maria Josephina of Jesus Crucified wrote her autobiography and her diary, as well as many letters and exhortations for her sisters. The beatification ceremony took place on 1st June 2008 in the Cathedral of Naples in Italy. Placing all our petitions before her today, let us pray. Almighty and Eternal God, who will to conform to Christ crucified the Virgin Blessed Mary Josephine as a victim for sinners, grant that we, through her intercession and example, may always embrace our own cross and humbly fulfill your will, through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God for ever and ever. Amen.